Hey guys, it's the Swole Clock here, and today inside of this Monster Legends Elite video, we have all the events for this week, as well as the main event for next week. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so the main event for next week is a brand new Tails Challenge for Not a Lotus. Not a Lotus is this monster right here, and his design does look very, very cool. I like it a lot. And he is, of course, the new Christmas monster. So yeah, this event will start next week on Friday, and that is where you're going to go ahead and get the monster, and then you can start collecting tokens on Monday, actually. And that is next Monday. So yeah, go ahead and start collecting tokens to rank him up and then on friday go and get him out of the event and that is pretty much all you need to know about the not a lotus tailless challenge so yeah, now let's go and move into this week's events. All right, so Monday through Thursday are all actually exactly the same. They have the exact same events. We have the Maze Island, the Vosker Challenge, and the Top Breeding. So the Maze Island is really good. You can get some good stuff out of that, including Christmas chests. Those are always great. And the Vosker Challenge is okay. Vosker isn't very good, but if you need them for books, you can go ahead and try to get them. But if you don't need them for books, I would just skip out on the event. And then the Top Breeding is great. You can get a bunch of new mythics out of that for completely free. The breeding events are always really good to do. And yeah, all three of those events will go until Thursday and then they will end and new events will happen on Friday. And on Friday, the Clock Workshop Marathon, the Collector's Breeding, and the Paths for Fatal Herald and Mortal Ming start. So the Clock Workshop Marathon is of course great. You can get a brand new mythic out of that, but you do have to make sure you are in a good enough team to actually get the mythic. So definitely keep that in mind. Try to find a good team by Friday. And then the Collector's Breeding is another breeding event. So that is really great. Just free mythics out of that. Definitely go ahead and do it. And there are also going to be mythics from a certain book so that you can go ahead and try to complete that book. So that is very, very good to do. And then the Fatal Herald and Mortal Ming Paths are kind of like the challenge where you don't really need the monsters. They're not really too great. But if you need them for books, you should go ahead and still get them. And those will go into Saturday. And then the other events, I believe, will go all the way until next Thursday. So you have a ton of time to do the marathon and the collector's breeding. But make sure to do the paths fast if you want to get those done. Yeah, those are all of the leaked events for this week as well as the main event for next week. The main ones you want to focus on are the marathon and the maze island. Those are the two big main events. And then you want to also do the breeding events. Those are really great for free mythics. And yeah, I could probably say skip out on all of the other events, to be completely honest. So just do the maze, the marathon, and then the Bernie events. Make sure to find a good team for the marathon by Friday so that you can participate in it. Yeah, that's going to be for this video. I don't want to like, share, and subscribe more videos like this. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.